Hello, buddy. And I'll be right back. <laughs> what is it, Mr. Slay? What do you feel? <laughs> Jesus! Jesus Christ! Great job, new kid. But your journey is not yet complete. Next! But should we ever need your services again, we will come. Great job! You just on the snook! South Park is saved! Yes. Now let's finish this, new kid. Let's beat Glad once and for all and take back the stick of two! better. Don't keep my f on the fire damage. My crown any good. Yes it is. I hope you're ready, Clyde. You brought this upon yourself. You wished us away. We banished you from space and time. But you had to come back, didn't you? Well then, let's end this, shall we? My friend. You asked for this. Oh, wait, no. Okay, this way. You asked for this, Clyde. I hope you're ready. There we go. Paddling away. Watch the world burns around them. Stan, this is it. The final battle. The disco rave of the tango. Are you ready, my friend? For tonight, we dine on his blood! Fool! Yeah! You thought you could conquer the fortress of darkness? Yeah, kind of. Right, back away from that stuff. Well, but I have yet to complete my army. You have come to witness the power of darkness. Stop! You have no idea what that stuff is! Yeah, huh? Green sauce from Taco Bell. I took it from their construction site. Dude, that's not Taco Bell sauce. Then why'd I find it as Taco Bell? It leaked out of a UFO, Clyde! It's toxic goo from another galaxy! Think about it! Since when does Taco Bell have a green sauce, dude? Actually, since about a year ago. What? Taco Bell has green sauce now. No way! They've had it longer than a year. I've always gotten spicy green burritos. Yeah, no, I'm saying in the packets. They just started putting green sauce in packets. The fuck? How the fuck did I miss it? Ha-ha! I don't seem so foolish now, do I? That doesn't mean you have Taco Bell green sauce, dip fuck. Yeah, Clyde, why do you think that shit's glowing? Maybe because of the three varieties of chili peppers. Just give us a stick, asshole. Or what? You'll speak me up? Ha <laughs> ha! I've got another surprise for you. To your woman. This is bad. Get him, Commander Defend! Yes, my lord. If that is your command, it shall be done. So saith the great commander. Oh god. It did not just happen. You got armor, I assume? Yep. Can't let you have armor. Kill! They started to try it! Are you ready, Stan? This is it, Stan! Hmm. 
pissed on. you tell them your real name, Dovahkiin? Oh my god. You don't remember, do you? How we tried to find you? Look, that stick belongs with the Fighters of Zara. Give it back. Fighters of Zara? Boys, what's going on here is much more complex than that. This isn't the first time a UFO has crashed to Earth. You see, in 1947, a UFO crashed in Roswell, New Mexico. Oh, God. Oh, brother, spare us. Hang on a sec. A UFO crashed in Roswell, and a new government agency was created to investigate the paranormal. Our agency. Can we skip this? Like, hit the skip button or something? Oh, you don't want to skip this. Yes, we do. Whenever aliens are spotted, vampires run amok, our agency is there, and we have never lost a fight. That is, until four years ago when we investigated a child. Yawn, yawn, yawn. A child who had an unnatural power inside him. 
I had orders from the president to secure the child so that we could harness his powers before our enemies could. But he slipped through our hands. The government wants the new kid for his farts? That's dumb. His farts? No! His amazing ability to make friends so quickly on any social network. <laughs> before he was five years old, he had 3.2 billion friends on Facebook alone. Do you have any idea the power that kind of gift yields in today's world? It's time to come with us, Dovahkiin. Time to stop resisting and use your gift for your country. Is he really still talking? Are we so different, you and I, Dovahkiin? Uh. You have to do what the government tells you to do, just like me. We're all just pawns in their game. I'll admit you are fascinating. You have more power than any child I've ever come across, and yet all you seem to really care about is this. It must be very important. What does it do? Whoever controls the stick controls the universe, dumbass. Yeah, stupid. Controls the... But then... I wouldn't have to do what I was told anymore. I could... <laughs> I control the universe! Get back! Back, I say, all of you! I can do anything! Anything I want! <laughs> I no longer need you, new kid! I control the universe! Should we be on the opposite sides? Join me, Dovahkiin. Rule by my side. Rule. And you can have this all to yourself forever. He's I can lying. offer you all. Just get me safely out of here. You can rule with this once again. You underestimated the character of the fighters of Zaron. What binds us is more than that relic. And you failed to recognize the character of our alliance. Yes. And that friendship is more important to any of us than even the stick of truth. Dude, where are you going? <laughs> oh my god. Princess Kenny! Nice. At least one of you has some sense. You'd sell us all out? But why, Princess Kitty? Because Princess Kitty was born a half-orc. Oh whose my. entire village was... Morgan Freeman! Yes. Morgan Freeman? You see... When humans and elves lived together in the forest of Hollow Falls, an elven queen fell in love with the orc known as Dandar, the first one to possess the Stick of Truth. They loved in secret and had a child. A beautiful little girl, a girl who watched as everyone she loved was killed in cold blood. And that is why she waited and plotted all this time to take the stick from you. For Princess Kinney is true heir to the Stick of Truth. Wow, Morgan that's Freeman. pretty cute. Just one thing, Morgan Freeman. How come every time something convoluted needs explaining, you show up? Because every time I show up and explain something, I earn a freckle. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Princess Kitty, come back here! And that happened. So, this is how it'll end. The grand finale, as you would say. The ultimate battle. Ah, good. Welcome. Can I interest you in something? You have quite a lot of junk to sell. Um, let's 
So you got that. You gotta put the hundred shots on you. You can't have anything. You're already spec and you're already spec. Can I interview you? I need all the persons I can get. So, how will our little adventure end, you might ask? The new kid charged into the enemy fortress. But... <coughs> did not win as originally anticipated, but instead had fallen victim to the Thank you. I'm not kill. Anyways, that's what really upgrade. I mean use that. I'll upgrade you. Boom. I think he can be gross now, but oh well. She plays hot shit, go be fucking son of a fucky! Fuck me! I hope you fuck fucking got it! Hey, you! Fat bitch! I've been walking ass, goddammit! I did a bit of damage. You're a rainbow! <laughs> Princess Kitty! Princess Kitty! One, two, three. Cartman, roast him out again. Princess Guinea. This could go really wrong. This is it, King Douchebag. The final battle. Your buddy stand with you. I will just stand over here. Use your rainbow attack, Princess Guinea. It's even weaker now. Did you not even think of that? Yeah. 
No, can't call Cartman. You don't think it's the gods, Kenny. Hit them with the zombie vomit! <laughs> I need to eat some cookies. Yum 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 yum. Now then, slow your defense some more, shall we? Well, that doesn't feel so good, does it? Go boy. Stand. Bird. Yeah. That's enough of that. I kill. Let's do it. Yes, drink your goo, Princess Kitty. You'll be invincible. Oh no, you don't. Shit, I shanked it. Well, so she can fully heal herself. Good, but our defense stays down at least. No dose trays. Die! Do a lot more damage now. Kyle, empower yourself. Let's fuck it up! Okay, Kyle, I need you to only kill her. Ready? Oh, are we 
Take it, right now? Come on, let's do this! Me? I want to heal myself. Stan, mark for death quickly. Attack! Time for the demon hide. Time for the demon hide. 